Hi, we're Campus TV standing in front of the student library where they're busy chucking biscuits at the windows. The students are furious for Glynis leaving with such a high pay package. Um, I think that it's it makes sense that she stays for at least a little while. Um, you can't you can't just you lose a leader of a oh, university. What does your sign say? And this is buy your own buddy biscuits. Uh, normally you would expect A, not to go on sabbatical at the very end of your career, yeah. and B, you would expect to go on to a normal academic salary if you're on sabbatical. Yeah. And they're employing her for up to February 2019 on new tuition fees. So I actually think she should go earlier. And we also need the people that make this happen go as well. I mean, the, the, the important issue here is not even money. The important issue is freedom. Freedom. So education is a business and that's why we're here today. She's not resigning, she's getting a comfortable retirement with 600,000 pounds of pay before she leaves. Because I Do feel like the university is, is run undemocratically, without transparency, and they're not accountable to the students. It's a dictatorship. It's 9k a week, it's like one of our fees, whole year worth of fees. You can see this kind of inequality happening everywhere, uh, not only in this country, but everywhere in the world. Uh, yeah. so. There needs to be a clean out and it needs to happen now do you think it's practical to get rid of her immediately with literally no transition period do you, do you see that as a problem uh, we have the deputy vc we have the deputy president or whatever there is a structure in place where the system would still be managed without her presence uh, 86 percent of the students said there they had no confidence in the university's governance structures including council and remuneration committee now we have the mandate of that many students clearly we, we have no the SEU has no confidence in the university's uh, governance structures. I think Glynis has already gone and these lot just want an excuse for a protest and to advocate for socialism, which doesn't work, to be quite honest with you. I want to study in the library, they should take a bit more responsibility on and keep their mouth shut, to be quite honest with you. Glynis is gone. Thanks very much. Have a nice evening. Why are you here? Are you to, to protest. <laughs> what are you protesting? The Chancellor. What about her? Uh, I don't know, to be honest. Just saw everyone coming here, thought, thought we'd join in. I, don't, I, I wasn't actually sure what the protest was about until I got here. Do you think that's a general consensus for most of the protest? I think that's probably fair. I, I, I genuinely have no... I, I think it's something to do with Glynn's resigning, but she already resigned, so... Sorry? Do you think the swearing undermines your argument? No. <laughs> Hi, I'm here with Canvas TV where a dance party seems to have broken out. Welcome to the protest. Have you, have you noticed that the poster has a little, little typo on it? No, I had not. I think I was handed over this poster, oh, and now no. I'm thinking that maybe it was meant to undermine the protest. 